Hi ladies, I am in my house and I'm just about to do my packing for summer. Um, I've done lots of packing videos over the years, but this one is different from when I went away for my holiday a couple of weeks ago. And this is for a two week holiday. And I've got a lot of old friends, mainly old summer friends, because I find with my wardrobe in the summer, it's far more about things I've collected over the years than about new purchases. But this year, I'm probably half a stone, which is about, I don't know, five kilos more than I was last year. So I've had to kind of rethink a few things that I put on really old friends. Hello, good morning, everybody. And they're now like, but I'm literally a kind of straw bursting out of a sack. So um, I'm gonna start off with my accessories and then I'll go on to my clothing rail and a few other things. So there's a lot today, ladies, a lot. I just say good morning to everyone. Good morning, Madeline. Good morning, Janet. Good morning, Heidi, Vanessa, Catherine, um, Mary. Um, am I the right, right way around? I think I am. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. So um, let me just get myself sorted. Hang on a bit, so one second. There. I just want to start on the bottom, then I'm gonna, Good morning, good morning, good morning, Steph. Good morning, everybody. So I um, I like to have everything with me when I pack because uh, when I kind of arrive at a destination where I'm not quite sure, most places in Europe have a great pharmacy and European pharmacies are a wonderful place of exploration. But I kind of like to have everything with me just in case I don't get stuff. So I'm going to go through my um, my five different bags I have here, all with things. You might think it's quite a lot, but this will fit into one big suitcase and one kind of smaller hold all. Um, so I haven't got the suitcase up here, they're downstairs, but you'll get a general idea. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. So I'm gonna start, I'll just start with whatever comes out first. So let's see what this is. This is my vitamin pack um, here. And this is like my, what I call my medical bag. So, I mean, it's, it's so tedious to start with this one, but it's kind of good. So I've got things like magnesium, which I take for night. Um, and in there, it is just magnesium because I take quite a few a night. So I've had to take the whole thing. Um, I've got, I know it's really strong and it's not organic, but I've got jungle formula um, mosquitoes because where I'm going is very mosquito-y. Um, and then what I've done, I've got a little soothing gel from Savlon. Um, and I've got all my vitamins in here. Uh, luckily, all my vitamins are different shapes and sizes, and I've taken them for quite a long time, so it's a bit faffy, but it means everything is in here for two weeks supply, and I counted two weeks of vitamins in each one, and I take that. I used to decant um, into um, very small little bags, and I was so anal, and I just thought, oh, Life is too short, I can't do that. So everything is in here for two weeks. I take, as you know, about 10 different vitamins a day. Then I've got silly little things for Lila, like I've got Pyrites, because she has a bit of hay fever and allergies. I've got Benadryl for anyone on holiday. I've got a heat pad. I could probably get the local pharmacy, but if somebody did their back in when, you know, water skiing or something, um, what else do I got in here? Oh, I've got, you know, glycerine suppositories in case I have a moment. That's a real intimate, um, intimate sharing. So that's what I call my medical bag, but it has in it all my, um, and that's in a Trini London wash bag, by the way. Um, then I'm gonna go to, ah, oh, my, this is all my skincare that I'm gonna take, like that. So in here, I've got decanted everything that I love. So I start off with, um, things that don't take up much room where two weeks supply is enough of four grams is two weeks supply. So this is in fact Sizzly eye cream. It's the only eye cream I really use and it's more a sort of cosmetic thing. I just want it to be, sorry, that's my Pilates class coming up. I just want it to be, you know, on holiday you need to nurture yourself. I have creme de la mer lotion in there, which is just a treat for me and I had a little bit left so I put it in there. And I've got Sizzly day. So I'll mix those two up as my day ones. And then at the bottom, I've got an empty pot because I might need to put a tiny bit of sunscreen in it. If I'm going out in the evening and suddenly I feel I'm burning, I've got that little pot. We sell these on Trinity London, by the way, which I can snap in to my makeup. So that's that one. I've got a full tube of light medium BFF because light medium came out. And I've also just put 
to go in a medium because I won't probably tan anywhere on my face, but I might get my arms brown. I want my skin to not look too pale. Um, I've got um, Talika Eyelash Conditioning Gel and I use this on my lashes and on my eyes um, because it just gives a little bit of a, a brightness to your, to your lashes. And if you wear lashes like me, you can't use mascara, but I want to just, you know, have that, that moment. So I have that. Um, I've got Listerine because I occasionally smoke <clears throat> and I want to have good breath. Uh, I've got Swala, which is a really nice colour from Trini London because, as I said, I might let my arms go a little bit brown, so I want my face to go brown. So if I put this on just to show you, I can put that on like that and just rub it in. There's two colours. It comes in Genster, which is the paler shade, and Swala, but it just gives you an immediate tan like that and that's all I need. I don't like particularly fake tan because I do get clogged pores with it. So that now, I could have just come back from holiday and I could just put it on and on and on. It's a really good gel formula so you don't see it in bright sunlight, which I also, I don't like. Um, then I've got um, CE Ferulic. I brought the whole thing because on holiday, vitamin C is so important to wear because it's a very good preventer as well as post of um, pigmentation. And I always put a lot of that under my sunscreen. It really helps me. Um, I've got from Sisley, this is not in the right container, their leg oil. And this is a wonderful product from Sisley. It's, it's like heavy leg oil. And it's got lots of things in it that kind of get rid of water retention and just make your legs feel lighter. Um, and I need that a lot. And somebody I met, one of the ladies who is who follows me on Instagram is also saying I don't know how many of you know this who suffer from heavy legs because I occasionally would take water retention pills and I hated doing it I tell you stopping sugar I'm on day seven of no sugar uh, and literally no fruit no sugar um, I've noticed that I'm not so swollen in my face here and I'm not so swollen in my legs, even though in London it's been 27, 28, 30 degrees. So it's really unusual for me. But I find when I'm on holiday and I'm sitting at a tight table and it's like a taverna and I've got my legs crossed, I get this really heavy leg. So this woman said to me on the weekend, consider cucumber juice. Um, and she said it's brilliant uh, and mixed with fennel. So I might just get some fresh cucumbers um, wherever I am. But that's just, I, I want to pass that on. I have Imperial Roger Galet. It's a very light fragrance. Usually I have an oil because in the summer, I don't like, if you spray here and here, you'll get a dark spot. So I usually just put this in my hair a bit. Um, I've got a tiny baby Vintner's Daughter. It's like a little baby to its mama. This is an oil that I've used for about three years. I was introduced to it by Caroline Hirons and it's a gorgeous oil. You might think in the summer do you want an oil, but I just, there are times when you get back from a long day out and it's been very hot and I'll do a really good exfoliation then I'll put a bit of that on. Um, I've got a, a cleanser here. I wish I could show you the proper packaging. This is Nanette de Gaspé's cleanser and I've decanted it from its beautiful black bottle, but her whole range has this sort of black ingredient, this amazing, I've been using this range now for three weeks, so I'm gonna do a proper review on it. It is, I know, don't cross my legs with you, but sometimes the table's so tight you have to, um, but you're right. Uh, and it's, um, it's got in it exfoliator, cleanser, moisturizer and toner, and a lip balm. Um, and it's brilliant, it's so expensive, but I love it, so I've, um, put that cleanser down there. Uh, then I have got uh, Dr. Seabag's exfoliating mask. Now you might think it's weird to have a kind of glycolic mask on holiday, but I think that I produce more, you know, even though our skin regrowth goes on um, a 28 day cycle or whatever, I still feel everything grows more in the sun and I like to have a very clean skin and I do wear SPF 50 so I'm fine to do a bit of exfoliation when I'm on holiday that's a, that's a um, glycolic one. And then I also have the Demamiel cleanser, which I've decanted in here, and that's enough for two and a half weeks. It's quite generous, actually, for two and a half weeks. Um, and then I have exfoliator, which is a physical exfoliator, and I've mixed together because I'm, I'm trying to just go through all my things properly. So I've got the Dr. Lancer one in there with a bit of Tata Harper. It's going to be 
it's going to actually make the Dr. Lancer one smell nice because it doesn't really smell. Um, then BO Effect, um, the um, EGF serum. That's what I use at night. It's a really simple, wonderful um, serum. It's great for cellular regeneration. God knows how it's worked. It's Icelandic. I've used it for about three years and I love it. And I actually have with me their two day serums. I might use them. I don't know if there's much left in them, but I'm going to do, that's kind of, my moment and then I have a sizzly mask um, the rose mask which I love so all of that goes in let me just repack it for you it goes in here and I'm not going hand luggage so it's fine but I, I kind of feel that's not going over the top um, it's everything I need yes yes it is let me just see if there's anything here I'm missing now I think it's everything I need and I'm still feeling that I'm bringing with me my full um, skincare regime which I'm loath not to. So let me just make sure everything, always make sure everything's really tightly closed. Sometimes we throw things in a bag um, and they, we take them from our bathroom and we've been using them the day before and we don't make sure that they've been snapped and closed and locked and they're not seeping. There's nothing worse than arriving at your destination and everything is um, falling out your bag and oiled up. So that goes in there. So that's all my makeup stuff for two weeks it might seem a lot to me it doesn't seem a lot because i have about 10 stages of a regime there 